Last week we talked about array.find, which returns the first value in an array that matches a user-defined function. That's pretty cool, but probably a more frequent use case is wanting all of the values that match the function, right? In comes array.filter, which does exactly what we want, and in a non-destructive way. It returns a whole new array instead of manipulating the existing one. Here's an example. Same exact function as last time, but now we're going to use array.filter. And we'll console log the result. Save the file, and our console will show an array that looks like this. Wolverine, Mystique, Quicksilver. That's incredibly handy, not just for sorting comic book heroes, but for all kinds of data manipulation. Next week, we'll cover three useful array methods introduced in ES6 that will help with iterating over an array's indices, values, or both.